All right. Hello. Uh, this is very strange. Um, what is popping, everybody? Welcome uh, to the video. Uh, I've not uploaded for the past month, and I'm here today uh, to not really like give myself an excuse as to why I've not uploaded. It's here to basically just to apologize, and I don't have an excuse. That's why I've not really uploaded over the past, let's say, um, I guess, I, I don't know, dude, like, ever since Sword and Shield came out, ever since, I guess, December, uh, I kind of had that drive to make content, and ever since December came uh, and happened, I just had no drive to make content whatsoever, I've literally just not even bothered being sat on my computer, like, it's literally, I found, like, my Switch out, and it had dust and shit all over it, and I was like, bro, like, I can tell, this has been a long time since I've been sat on my computer, um, I don't know really as to why I lost my passion to do YouTube. I guess it was like trying to like figure out what I really wanted to do in life and kind of like, you know, I thought to myself like I'm 25 now and I kind of wanted to, you know, what but like I'll jump back. Like before when I was like 20, I thought when well, by the time I'd be 25, I'd literally have my life sorted, like I'd have my house, I'd have like a steady income of money. Um, but I really don't. <laughs> I never really don't. Uh, and it's pretty funny because I have to laugh at it or else I'll just start crying my eyes out. Um, I've got to laugh at it because, you know, as, as being my age that I am at now and I still don't understand what I want to do for the rest of my life, whether it be content created because I know that's not going to happen forever, whether it's doing YouTube as a hobby and, and trying to find myself, you know, working for like a family business or going out there and getting a job. Um, I feel like I've just been lost in a way for the past two years. I guess year and a half. I've been lost in a, in a way that I've never really gone through anything like it before. As to where uh, before I used to be super like content driven. Like I'd be streams every other day. There'd be videos every other day. Uh, and I guess like for the past few months, a lot of my viewers have seen it as well. And it's so nice to hear that so many of you people were, you know, missing the content and stuff on Twitter. I'd see so many people comment, you know, saying, Christian, when you're coming back, I miss seeing your face. You know, it's so, you know, rewarding and so, like, I don't know, heartful, if that's even a word, um, to see that. Because, you know, as to me, I'm just a random dude that just lives, you know, in England. And a lot of you guys really look up to it, you know, as, as look up to me. It, it, it's crazy. Um... I was at PAX East literally um, a few weeks ago. Uh, I was there with all of Gang Gang. Um, and it was literally such a... I want to like... You know what I want to do? I want to throw out big words at you. So you're like, God damn it, Christian, you are so smart. And I'm sat there like with my pipe and my legs crossed. I'm like... Mm -hmm. uh, but I literally like... At PAX, it was so much fun um, getting to hang out with all the crew again. Um, I, I've not seen them in a very long time. And... You know, yeah, it felt good, like, to see everybody and talk to everybody, you know, talk about content creating and just, like, being around all my other content creator friends. They were like, wow, you know, it, it kind of made me feel like, damn, all right, bet, I'm going to get home, I'm going to start picking up YouTube as a hobby again, I'm going to start streaming every now and again, you know, random videos every now and again, and try to get myself back into it. Um, I've been working uh, for my family at the minute. Um, as, as you know for income and stuff like that because obviously I've not been doing YouTube But I just didn't want to let people keep paying to be members to me Um, and me just not doing no content I don't think it's fair on you guys having to pay for a service that you I, literally you are getting nothing of I feel like to me that's really really like you know Degrading as a content creator for myself because it feels like I'm literally giving you nothing in return Now I know a lot of people will sit there and go Christian look I don't care I will give you this money. I love you. I support you and you know, you don't understand how appreciative I'm of that ass, but I Don't feel like I'm giving you like, you know what you're paying for and uh, that's just me I mean you guys can uh, take that you know how you want but for me. I feel like I I've not been up to par I feel like I need to pull the finger out and be like, look, listen, I literally just got two brand new lights. You know, the camera quality is looking kind of slick, right? The camera looks sick. It looks better. Looks so good. Um, and I was so ready to jump back into it. I really was so ready to jump back into it. And then I just stopped and I just up and left and went. Um, but I, I don't understand why. And I can't really, like I said, I can't give you a reason as to why I did it. I just stopped. Um, you guys obviously know about my friend Dom who died. Uh, that was some months ago, and ever since it was just then, I just lost all my passion for it, and it's so heartbreaking when I think back and I look back on it, because I've been, you know, presented an opportunity to do a job that 
I absolutely love, to play a game that I absolutely love, to stream any game that I absolutely love, in front of an audience who support me yet every single day, who watch my videos every single day, who go out of their way to say when they've had a bad day, they put a video on of myself and a friend or just myself and think, damn, I am actually feel so much better. And I can't, you know, just keep thinking to myself, it's all right, I'll upload next week, I'll upload next week, because it doesn't work like that. It really does not work like that. And you guys don't understand, like, I literally wish I could just pull it out. I just literally wish I could get that content drive that I had, like, years back. But it, it's hard, man. It really hard. Like I said, I've always loved Pokemon. I will always love Pokemon. But playing the game, it's over and over again. It can get stale and it can burn you out and it can dry out your motives and, you know, your creative drive to, to produce content. Now, it'd be a different story if, like, I was playing just normal games. Like, let's say, um, any new game that came out, I just bought it, played it, and that was that. Um, it'd be a different story because I've been playing a different game every single time. I've played Heart Gold a bunch of times. I've played Pokemon Black, White... X and Y a bunch of times. I really have. And it's the same game over and over again. Yeah, it's different when it's a randomizer. It's fun. Um, I'd prefer much to do content with somebody else in terms of that. Whether it be a live Let's Play or, you know, like a collab where it's like a series that I'm doing with someone like Luke, for example, with the Soul Link. Uh, Paras, you know, for example, with the Cage Locks and stuff like that. And those are the type of content that I want to do. But to me... And I've said this to my friends, and they've said it as well, and it's it banter, but it's the truth that they say. I can't just be like, okay, let's message Pat. Pat, let's do a cage lock. Let's bring it back. Luke, let's bring back Soul Link. Let's bring back Soul Link. Because I can't. Because there's no need for them to want to be like, all right, cool, yeah, let's get the graphics, get it sorted. And then two weeks into the Soul Link, I just up and leave. And they didn't hear nothing from me. So for them, you know, of course, as it's their full-time job and it's like a business, I can't just put that type of strain on their business so for me for anything like that i'd want to be able to fully be back into content creating and uploading every day and streaming every day because i would you guys literally don't understand like i've created this whole office space i've created something online that people have seen me and wanted to come up and have a photo with me wanted to have autographs with me i've created something online that i felt like i've just let go and I don't know why I've done it. I really don't know why I've done it. And I'm just here to say sorry, man. I'm just here to say sorry. Um, just please note that I do want to do content creating. It's finding the thing that I want to do. I think is the major like thing about it. It's finding the thing that I want to do. And it's getting that drive back again for it. Because, dog, I'd love, I'd love to stay. I'd literally just stay in my house all day i'm here with my dog and um, you guys have not seen mia in so long right you miss her in the streams and you know for me to be able to, to work from home is probably one of the best feelings in the world anybody would love to do it i have this opportunity in front of me i still live with my parents so i still have the opportunity to save money and save money but because i've not done it for so long i've kind of lost all the drive in myself as a person like i'm so used to like now literally just doing nothing it's kind of become my lifestyle and it's trash it's shit it is so shit and i hate it i really do and it, i think it's about time i pulled the finger out in it i think it's about time i pulled the finger out doing youtube has been one of the uh craziest experiences in the world for me it's had its ups it's had its downs it's been the best job i've ever had in my whole entire life and I mean, I've only had like three jobs, like, but <laughs> you get the idea. Um, it's the best thing I could ever do with my life for now, I guess, uh, until I figure out what else I want to do, you know. But still, you know, there's a lot of support and there's a lot of people out there who want to see my face. And I, I can't just, you know, be as grateful to be in an opportunity like this. Like I said, still at home so I can save money to get a house. I, I've never been, you know, been put in a better position, really. And I feel like for myself, I've kind of taken it for granted, like being at home and stuff like that. I feel like I really need to, and this is like literally me speaking like flat out. Like I've been like proper serious with you guys. Um, it's me thinking that I kind of want to grow up and sort things out. And I kind of want to get back into the YouTube game and stuff. But, you know, like I said, 
I've just had packs that was absolutely amazing. Getting, you know, media tickets and stuff. I have uh, Insomnia next month. And literally, we have meet and greets, we have signings, we have stage events and stuff like that. And these opportunities are constantly presenting themselves for me to be here. Hello, look, it's your boy Finn. We're doing bits. Here's what I'm about. You know, and it's getting that drive just to say, right, you know, all right, today we're doing this. Today we're doing that. Today we're doing that. Even if it wasn't even working Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Like, let's say it, if it wasn't like literally doing this job from a Monday to Friday job, right? And let's say finishing this, whatever I do, like on a Friday at 7 p.m. And then having the rest of the weekend to chill out. The only thing I feel like with YouTube is you super strain yourself because... If you work every single day, you do the same thing every single day, you know, video stream, video stream, video stream, video stream, Monday to Sunday. Like, dude, you're not giving yourself no break, even though you're at home, you're still not giving yourself a break. Like, uh, for one person I always look up to and appreciate is Patters. Patters is a really good friend of mine, and I mean, that man doesn't stop working, like, he streams. He literally got home from PAX and started streaming. Everybody was jet lagged, and Pat's like, all right, OBS, open up. Let's hit record, guys. What's popping, everybody? It's Patters, and we are Shiny Hunting Dark Knight. And I was like, bro, we, we just got back a few hours ago, and he's already streaming. And that's that dedication that I wish I had, and I have had, but I've lost it. But I feel like still with YouTube, if I came back at it, I'd have to really, like, either go at it or just completely stop. And I mean, what, we're at 77,000 subs now. We're so close to 100k. That was the, my main goal ever since I started my channel. If I could have hit 100,000 subscribers, wow. And it's possible. You know, I have the support and help from my friends who are willing to help me to get there. And, you know, it's, it's just me. So this is my friends, right? And this is me. It's leaning on them all the time. But I need to push myself up here. It's me that needs to do the effort. It really is. Um, so that's how I felt for the past month. I no, not even the past month, dog. Like, I mean for like the past year. That's how I felt. And it's only down to me. And you know, it's time I pulled the finger out, so. Yeah, let me know what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts, because I do love to know your guys' thoughts, and I'd love to read all the comments and stuff like that you guys think about how I should approach it. Um, it'd be greatly appreciated. If you've watched the video all the way through to the end, that's a massive thank you. I've not uploaded in a while, so I don't really imagine a lot of people will watch, but if you have, massive thank you to you. Um, but yeah, I've missed it. I really have missed it. I just need the guidance. And I need to pull the finger out. And it's all down to me to do it. It really is. So, yeah. Um, thank you guys for watching. Like I said, thumbs up the video. Uh, subscribe if you guys are new, I guess. Um, but yeah. Just know that I'm doing well. I'm okay. I'm still here. I've not caught the coronavirus. Even though that shit's deadly as hell. Um, <laughs> and I'm doing well. So, don't worry. Okay. Um, please, please, please follow me on Twitter to keep up to date with all the things that I post on there. My social media. My Instagram and stuff like that is all linked down below. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching.